Hi, good morning students. So, how are you today? Fine? Great! I wish everyone are fine and healthy. So now, we meet in grade 6. So you have already in grade 6 now. Okay. Now I will explain to you your first material in the classroom. English classroom. Okay. Uh, in this year, we use Big Show as our book. Right. Okay. So I wish everyone has already read the book, has already uh, learned about the book, okay? Now, this is your first material. Where is this place? Let's start. Okay, this is some points I will give to you in this video, okay? There are five points, first objectives, second vocabularies, third sentence pattern, fourth example, and fifth post test. Okay, let's start in first point. Objective. What we will learn in this lesson? We will learn about public places and what we usually do in that public place. Jadi, apa sih tujuan pembelajaran kita di lesson ini? Kita akan belajar mengenai tempat umum ya, yang sering kita temui di kehidupan kita sehari-hari. Dan apa sih yang biasa kita lakukan di tempat-tempat umum tersebut? Nah, let's check it out. And the second is vocabularies. Jadi kosa kata kosa kata apa saja sih yang akan kita gunakan uh, di lesson ini? Those vocabularies, okay? Okay, I want you to write down in your book, okay, about the vocabularies. And after that, you should translate the vocabularies into bahasa Indonesia. Jadi kurang lebih ini adalah Kosa kata yang akan kita gunakan ini mengenai public places. Nah, memang kamu menuliskan uh, apa namanya pengertian atau artinya dalam bahasa Indonesia. What for? So itu supaya kamu uh, lebih bisa memahami dan sehingga nanti kita berjalan di materi ini nih kita berjalannya mulus, lancar gitu ya anak-anak ya. Oke. Okay? Don't be lazy to write down in your book. Siapkan satu buku tulis, kemudian kamu catat materi ini dari vocabulary sampai nanti di akhir. Oke? Okay? Sentence pattern. Oke, okay, the third part is sentence pattern. Yaitu grammar yang akan kita gunakan di uh, lesson ini. Entah cara kamu bertanya jawab, entah bagaimana uh, kamu menjelaskan mengenai public places dalam bahasa Inggris. Oke, okay, in this lesson we use questions and answer like this. Jadi ada dua. Yang pertama modelnya seperti ini. What is this place? This is bla 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 bla. Where bla 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 bla. Jadi Misalnya kamu lagi pergi sama teman kamu, kamu nggak tahu nih tempat apa sih itu. And then you ask your friends, oke? Okay? Eh, ini tempat apa sih? What is this place? Gitu. Terus teman kamu bilang, this is apa? Menjelaskan apa? Where, bla bla bla. Where itu di mana? Kita ngapain di situ biasanya? Contoh, this is the church where people pray. Gitu misalnya. Uh, ini adalah gereja di mana orang-orang berdoa gitu, atau where the Catholic people pray or the Catholics pray gitu ya di mana orang-orang uh, Katolik itu atau apa berdoa gitu itu contoh atau bisa juga seperti ini is this the bla 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 where you bla 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 and then the answer yes it is Or no, it isn't. Gitu. 
Contohnya, contohnya nih ya, is kayak kita masih pakai church ya. Is this the church where people pray? Gitu. Jadi ini you nggak harus you ya. Bisa juga people, bisa juga uh, apa they pray atau segala macam. Gitu. Oke, okay, kalau bisa jawabannya iya, ya kamu jawab yes it is. Kalau jawabannya no, ya jawabannya no it isn't. Gitu. Oke. Okay. Next. Okay, I will give you the example. Okay, look at the picture. There are uh, some children go to the convenience store. Okay, 7-Eleven is one of the convenience store. Okay, look at the questions and the sentence here. Is this the convenience store where you bought a snake? Oke. Okay. Apakah ini adalah uh, minimarket atau apa ya kita sebutnya toko gitu ya di mana kamu membeli snack atau cemilan gitu. And then friends say jawab, "Yes, it is." Gitu. Number two ini adalah model yang satunya tadi. Oke, okay, misalnya temannya lagi nanya tuh What is this place? Tempat apa sih ini? Terus kamu jawab, This is the convenience store where I bought a snake. Oke. Okay. Ini adalah toko di mana saya biasanya beli cemilan. Gitu. Oke okay, anak-anak, sampai sini paham? Oke. Okay. Ini ini uh, format atau guide kita untuk membuat percakapan di lesson ini. Oke, okay. jadi yang sudah tadi memang jelaskan itu uh, kita coba kerjakan ya di post test ini. Public place itu kan ada banyak banget ya tempat umum. Look at the test. Oke, okay, there are five numbers. Oke, okay. let's um, read before we answer. Oke, okay. you don't have to write it. We just ask and answer. Oke. Okay. Kamu gak harus tulis, kita hanya tanya jawab saja. Siapa tahu, kalau kamu bisa jawab, ya jawab. Kalau bisa, memang memang dia tidak bisa mendengarkan kamu menjawab, tapi sebisa mungkin kamu mencoba menjawab uh, post test ini ya. Oke, okay, number one, this is the bla 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 where I fix my computer. Number two, is this the bla 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 where you study? Number three, this is the blah 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 where you watch the movie. Number four, is this the blah 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 where you send a mail? Number five, is this the blah 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 where they have dinner? Okay, now let's answer the questions. Number one, lihat keluhnya. Fix my computer. Kira-kira apa ya tempat yang buat fix my computer? Oke, okay, repair shop. Repair shop. Jadi kamu udah tahu ya, repair shop itu buat apa? Atau toko apa sih repair shop itu? Oke. Okay. Number two. Clue-nya study. So where do you study? You study at school. Ya, yeah, so is this the school where you study? Apakah ini sekolah tempat kamu belajar? Bisa iya, bisa tidak. Iya enggak? Nah, number three. Look at the clue. Watch the movie. Where do you watch the movie? Di mana kamu biasanya nonton film? Bioskop. Nah, bioskop apa bioskop in English? It's movie theater. This is the movie theater where you watch the movie. Number four, number four. So yeah, number four. Look at the clue. You send a mail. Mail apa? Surat. Nah, di mana kamu biasa mengirim surat? Post office. Is this the post office where you send a mail? Number five. Cluenya have dinner. 
So where do you have dinner outside? Misalnya di luar tuh biasanya makan di mana? Restoran. Is this the restaurant where they have dinner? Apakah ini restoran di mana mereka makan malam? Oke. Okay. So class, I think enough for today. So if you still confused about the material, you can play again the videos and then you can listening again and after that uh, you can understand about the material okay don't be lazy to study don't be lazy to watch the video to listen to read your book okay now i will give you the video about public places okay happy watching and see you again bye bye